All right, folks, what is up? This is One Big Bugger, and if it's a little dark, I'm sorry. Uh, I don't like turning on my overhead light all that much, especially with my dome showing. And um, it's it's dark and overcast out because we decided to get all the bright, sunny, warm days ahead of Memorial Day weekend here on the East Coast. Um, and a lot of the East Coast, I, I believe, is covered. So, uh, man, I have got to trim. I have no trim this, so it, 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 it's it's dark out. Um, I just had to go and through and retalk to everyone quickly because the game didn't save. Forgetting this is an older game, it's not going to save like it should. So, like Something I can to. do for you, Commander. Uh, no. Carry on, Adams. Aye, aye, Commander. Just checking. All right, we talked to Tally then. Oh, hello, Shepard. Yeah, what's wrong? Are you okay? I don't know. Your ship is amazing, and your crew's been really great to me, especially your chief engineer. But I just sort of feel out of place. The Normandy runs so smooth, it feels like we're not even moving, and the engines are so quiet. How do you sleep at night? The silence wakes you up? Back on the flotilla, the last thing you want to hear is silence. It means an engine's died or an air filter shut down. Considering how old I guess you are. don't have to worry about that here. But old habits die hard. But it's more than just a silence. This ship feels so empty. It's like half the crew is missing. Back home, I couldn't wait to go on my pilgrimage. I couldn't wait to get away from the crowds. Now that I'm out here, I kind of miss them. Sometimes we don't appreciate what we have until it's gone. That's true. I'm starting to wonder if that's what the pilgrimage is really about. It's given me a whole new perspective on my people and our culture. You know, there's always a few who go on their pilgrimages and never return. I always assumed something bad happened to them. But maybe they just wanted a different life. You do plan to return to the migrant fleet, right? I could never abandon my people, Shepard. I will go back eventually. But we have to stop Saren first. Otherwise, I might not have a home to go back to. Good enough. I should go. See you later. Right doors over here. I am not going to talk to Liara right now, or um, whatever his name is. I am just going to go up here. I could go talk to Joker, but... Uh, uh, missions. Geth Interest Consuls received for the Geth Interest Cooperating Reach. The Colony of Noverna. The Consul needs to know why. I have attacked world of pharaohs. Your primary objective is to go to the Zeus Hope colony to investigate what Saren is after and why he sent the guest troops there. Yeah. But... I don't know where these places are. So... We've done everything else. have any assignments by the look of it. Oh yeah, I do. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Uh, there are several... Oh, yeah, we're working on that. And that. Can we just mark all these as viewed so they stop flashing? Sorry, writings, emblems. Doing that. Fanatical biotics in the Hades Gamma Cluster have kidnapped the chairman. Okay. Um, we got the missing survey team. Private 
tears. Strenuous system. I don't know. Let's, uh, let's see if we can find a strenuous system. Um, I still want to finish looking here. Just make sure there's nothing else to survey. First time I found something hidden in the asteroids like this. And I had to go back through every star system I'd been through to check over the asteroids again. Okay. Um, right. We want to go back to Sparta and land on that planet, which I forget which one it is, and see about getting that... Is it this one? No. And see about getting that... There we go. Because now that I've maxed out Tally's... Um, we won't take with us. Since we maxed out, maxed out Tally's electronics... I got there a lot easier last time. Whee! Let's lose all the... Okay. Nice, some armor plating, some parting weave, and some motorized joints. Okay, that's pretty cool. Let's get out of here. Excuse me, I gotta itch my ear. Okay, now let's go. We'll just go here. I have no idea where I'm going. Okay, well, we'll go here first. Boom! Nothing. 
something here, but we can't get there right now. I don't, I don't think it'll allow us there. There's another planet we could even land on, but alright, we can't, we're not allowed, either we're not allowed or, or we just can't get there anymore. So we're gonna zip over this way. Look for anything we can survey. Status. Sensors reveal three fusion torches propelling asteroid X-57. At its current rate of acceleration, the asteroid will collide with Terra Nova in approximately four hours. Analysis. Torches must be disabled to cease the acceleration. Hello. I heard your transmission. Can you hear me? You haven't found me yet, but I can't talk long. This must be a, uh... Shut down the fusion torches. I'm going to die. This must be God, a, uh... I hope you're hearing this. Expansion. DLC. That's us. Then we got that. And then the transmission tower. I did not tell you to get out of the... I had never seen this before. There is stuff here. I'm trying to do is provoke some kind of response. There is stuff here. We're headed in the right direction. I don't know who you are, but I'm damn it. Go. Yeah, the rockets aim for where you are, so as long as you're not where you were when they shot, they'll miss. There's a question mark over there, too. We'll have to go check that out. I hope I'm not here too early. Fresh 
me. Put those Charging down up. first. Release the Varen. They've been released. Yeah, there's still more here somewhere. I'm searching for stuff as well. Shields there. Ow! Oh, sniper. Right. Where is he? Oh, you Area guys secured. Alright, okay, area secured. We're good. I really should use grenades, but I'm not very big on them. I hear you. What's going on? Who are you? My name's Kate Bowman. I'm an engineer. I was part of the team assigned to bring this asteroid to Terra Nova. We were attacked yesterday by Batarian extremists. I've been hiding since they arrived. I think they know the torch went out. Why are they doing this? I don't know. But if this asteroid isn't slowed, millions of people on Terra Nova are going to die. If I find out anything, I'll... I've got to go. Good luck. Okay. Oh, and there's something here. I didn't think I'd make that. Oh, we got some more heavy armor, medium armor, and another shotgun. Awesome. Oh, and we are leveled up. Cool. So let's do the level up. Oh, I've got double level up. Uh, I'm not going to bother with Intimidate in this one. It's all charm because I'm being a good boy. We will max out our Spectre training. Uh, we want to get into our pistols. We definitely want our barrier. there and then we'll work on bumping our barrier up okay Ashley hmm. let's get that going let's put you up to the first level of that um, yep we're gonna do that we'll do that oh and then you're done okay Tally we really need to get you some hacking. Um, because you can use shotguns once we get you there. So we'll work on that too. Okay. That looks good so far. And then uh, inventory. Um, 
pistols? No pistols yet. I want to see if I can change this round. So I think chemical rounds are much better. Radioactive rounds work too. But um, I like chemical rounds over and most other, except armor piercing. Armor piercing is really good. Um, nothing, 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 and then nothing here. Okay. Ashley, the assault rifle, no, so I'm going to omni-gel it. Uh, shotguns, the scimitar, definitely. We'll omni-gel the rest. And then armor, is this heavy armor better? Uh, gives better shields, but not better damage protection. But that's a significant shield, so we will bump that. And right now, I've got no use for the medium armor. So, Tali. Um, you will eventually move to shotguns. No sniper rifles. Nothing else. Alright, so it's just ammo, huh? Well, these are mods. Sort them by level. I do not like anti-personnel rounds. keep those. Now the mods. Um, don't really need that. I'll keep the heat the, the heat sink threes. Keep the high caliber barrels. Keep the sighting. Keep the recoil damper for now. Okay. God. I didn't mean to... Uh, are you hurt? Takes more than that one shot to bring me down. Sorry. I didn't even realize you were human until... Well... I guess I'm not much of a soldier. Yeah, I know you're right. scared, but I'm here to help. Commander Shepard, with the Alliance. Simon. Simon Atwell. I'm the chief engineer on this rock. Listen, we don't have much time. The Batarians fired up the fusion torches. You've got to shut them down before we hit Terra Nova. What do you think there are four did? million people down there, Shepard. I... My family. They live in Aronis. My kids and grandkids. Nice communities. Good schools. Batarians everywhere, and I need to shut down all three torches. Anything else I should know? One of the torches is surrounded by live blasting caps. We were set up to excavate when we arrived at Terra Nova. I rigged them with proximity detectors. That tank of yours will set them off, so you'll have to go in on foot. Even then, they'll explode if you get too close. Just go slow and easy. You should be fine. You set them up. Can you disable them? Not from here. No. There are manual controls by the entrance to the torch facility inside the blast zone. You can disarm the caps there. One last thing. I had a crew working off-site when the attack hit. I'm worried about them. These Batarians are ruthless. I saw them smash the faceplates of guys working vacuum. And those Varen, I don't think they always wait for a corpse before feeding. Any idea where I can find them? They were running checks on our perimeter equipment. Easiest thing would be to tap into the transmission tower out on the surface. The equipment stations will show up on your sensors. I'll look for them, but the torches have to be my priority. Yeah, you're right. Saving Terra Nova is more important than my team. There were a bunch of engineers over at the main facility, but they're probably all dead. That are being held hostage by the Batarians. A woman named Kate Bowman contacted me. The Batarians haven't found her yet. Katie's alive? She's one of my best engineers. She signed on with her brother, Aaron, I, I think his name is. He's part of the security detail. I hope they're okay. Well, you'd better find a good place to hide. If the Batarians come back and find you... Yeah. I think I'll make myself scarce. Good luck, Shepard. Do, do, 
do. There is a question mark over here that I'm curious about. I guess it's up here. to slam into it. There's got to be stuff in Yeah, there's stuff in here. This computer is filled with operations logs, personnel journals for small pirate music station operated by X-57's engineers include script for several promotional messages, none of which appear to have been recorded. Okay, well, it's an Easter egg, and I got some more, um... Now, we've been there. Transmission tower. That is where I want to go. I know I said, if there's time, there's time. You hear me? I'm getting all kinds of interference. Damn this Sorry. There's a lot of feedback. Let's see if I can fix it. In the meantime, just keep doing what you're doing. Sound over there. Oh shit! Oh. <laughs> Thud. Is this something? That oh, looks like something. He's nothing. Okay. Well, I guess the transmission tower is up there. Because, of course. I'm not gonna find that. I'm trying to do the same thing as I've done before. I'm trying to look where I want to go without being able to because this thing likes to take off on its own depending on the direction you're looking in. Should be able to slide up here even if I've got to like crap up. No, I can't. It's too. Maybe there? Wow! <laughs> Lots of stuff showed up. Survey Station 3, Video Survey Station 1, Fusion Torch, Fusion Torch, Survey Station 2, Main Facility. Alright, well we didn't, we, we've been to that Fusion Torch, this is a Fusion Torch, and I'm guessing that's a Fusion Torch. So I'm gonna go way the hell over there.
cannot imagine what it's like to ride this thing. already really nice I think we're here a little early but eh. this explosion would have killed me instantly so apparently there was an explosion here many gels I didn't need but it's cool and this is why you go to these places so we've been to Survey Station 1, that's the radio, transmission tower, so we're going to go way over across to Survey Station 3. I'm not trying to go backwards, thank you. I mentioned earlier that I had actually been on People's Court, and I'm going to talk about this in the vlog, and I'm definitely going to talk about it after uh, my, my case airs. Uh, but some people may wonder, you know, why go to People's Court? You know, well, obviously, one, you're on TV, but, well, if you're on TV and you're on People's Court, chances are one of you, either the defendant or the plaintiff, depending on which one you are, it doesn't matter, is going to be... Well, quite frankly, embarrassed. Judge Millian's not known for being uh, gentle. She can be very brutal. And uh, that's part of the entertainment of People's Court. It really is. Um, so, you know, why would you risk becoming uh, uh, one of those? Well, I don't know if this is something I'm allowed to talk about, but I don't think it would hurt, because if they contact you, you're going to find out anyways. If you agree to appear on People's Court with your case, regardless of what happens, and I'm pretty sure that the uh, both parties get this, you're going to get some sort of uh, financial compensation, no matter what. Um, Heading to position. That means if you're the plaintiff and you lose, you're still going to get... $250, there's like a $500 thing that gets split between the defendant and the plaintiff. You're going to get $250 plus a $500 appearance fee. And so you're going to get $750. So even if you lose and you're the plaintiff, you're going to get something. And if you're the defendant, um, if you win, it, you know, if you successfully defend and you win as the defendant, you're going to get something. Whereas most times the defendant, you just walk out with the victory and also as the plaintiff if you win in small claims court just because you win your case doesn't mean you're going to get the money you have to then proceed to try and get the person that you won the case to pay you back and that can be a very long and drawn out process that may not even be successful in people's court they will pay you your victory if you're the plaintiff and if you win they will pay you the decision I don't know how it works with the defendant. If the defendant makes a agreement that people's court will pay it for him for the entertainment, um, as I wasn't the defendant here. But as a plaintiff, that's a huge deal. So there's the reason why you know you you appear, regardless of what happens, regardless of what side you're on, you're coming out with something. There, there's a little caveat there. There's I, I forget what it is with like if the defendant if he loses. A certain amount of money, then the then the money that you get for being the defendant kind of gets sapped off, but um, it's still it's still worth going uh, regardless of. Um, oops. The victim was badly beaten before being killed. It's getting even darker out with a pistol shot to the back of the head, close range, likely surrendered, only to be executed. And this is why nobody that's here is going to live. 
The central transmission tower is on the fritz again. No one ever listens to the warning about single point failure. I'm surprised the surface comps work half as well as they do. Oh, man. And there's nothing of interest here. Other oh, wait, 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 wait. I spoke too soon. Logic Arrest Tool 3. It's an Omni Tool. Nice. That, I believe, is Tali. Yes. Oh, wow. Wow, look at those stats. Look at those stats. Nice. That That's a good early tool for her. That is definitely a good early tool for Tally. Very good. Very good. All right. So we've been here. We've been here, here, and here. We've been to this torch. We've got to go to that torch, but there is one more survey station we're going to go to first. Now, I don't mind saying I'm, I'm the plaintiff. I was the plaintiff in this. Um, but again, I can't tell you what happened in my case. You know, that's that's not allowed. I can't I can't say what happened. But those are the reasons I cho I chose to go as a plaintiff because win or lose, I was going to get something, and, and if I won, um, you you know. I would be guaranteed to get what I was suing for. Now, I can't think of a better reason to go, although, again, you know, depending on which side of the rock you're on here, uh, you could be, you know, ha have to suffer quite a bit in terms of being made a fool of, because uh, that's what judge... I don't, I don't know how many cases... I, I watch people's sport... I used to watch people's sport quite a bit. Uh, I kind of fell out of favor of watching people's court after a while. Um, I'm hoping... I don't suppose I can just, like... Nah. No, I didn't think they'd let you cheese it like that. Oops. Okay, I see you. Right. And there's actually one around this corner. I could take a hit or two if I really need to. But, um... But, uh, you know, for, for the chance to, if you win, to definitely get your money, and even if you lose, you get something for your efforts and, for your, and whatnot, I, I think it would be worth it. So if People's Court ever contacts you and wants to go in, I would say yes. But, you know, that depends on how you feel about risking being... Oh, there's the third torch. Okay, well, we'll go to that one next, because we're going to be closest. Then we'll go to the final one. That's not what we're after right now. Right now, we're after this facility. Because, again, there's some good stuff here. You know, a little... Eep! Oh, actually, that almost pulled that off smoothly. Alright, alright. Still don't have the feel of this fracking uh, I hate how they did this now with 10 goals where I look. This does not make things easier. Hang on. See what I'm saying? I'm, I'm just trying to turn and I can't. Died from a single shot through his helmet, likely from a sniper. Whoever killed him didn't bother to search the body. Is still equipment in his service pack. Ooh, another Omni tool. Um, Form up. So, Omni tool. Uh, 
Uh, much better tech cooldown bonus, not as much shield bonus, not as much med recharge bonus. But the tech cooldown, though, that's big. Um, yeah, I'm going to go with that one instead, because I think the tech cooldown is much better. Allows you to use your abilities faster. I'm guessing that's the guy we just discovered. Damn it. Damn it. Fuck. We're gonna have to Omni Gel this one, I think. Yep. Wow! <laughs> that should not have happened. Sniper rifle saw it. Can I get a pistol, maybe? Please? Communications down. There's no co there's non-corporate dropships landing near the main facility. There are flashes of light over the horizon. I can't be certain, but I'm guessing it's heavy rifle fire. As per emergency protocol, I'm arming the defense drones. I'm not waiting for my pickup. I'm going to... To which the drones now are like, Hey! Get out. To me. Position. Not without an airlift. Heading out. Drones go. Rally round. take everything. <sighs> Ashley, uh, doesn't have the heat. Yeah, you know what? Yes. Um, let's give you the chemical rounds in that. Shotgun. I'm not really sold on either one. Let's go with the equalizer. Uh, I think the armor piercing rounds would be best here. And for mod, I saw rail extension. It's fine. There's just nothing. Alright, now we want to hit the fusion torch that's here. And we can see just over the horizon. I'm guessing that's the facility down there. I don't know if I shot all the rocket places, but I took out some of them. At least I thought I did.
Regroup. Um. Okay. Barrier. We have unity. Marksman. shutting down the torches. I won't ask you again. She knows it's pointless. Find this problem and deal with it. Get her out of here! Bro, 
you and I have a date. Ah, I could definitely use that. Pistol. Let's go straight into the inventory and. Oh, I forgot to look at the armor upgrades as well. Hey, two pistols. Uh, yeah. We're just gonna take that one, and we're gonna omni gel this one. Why? Well, Tally needs this pistol. I need to make put her on pistol as well. I think she's using a shotgun, which she's, which I think she'll be stronger with a pistol right now. Uh, armor. What do we got for armor upgrades here? Omni gel that. Chip away while impact reduction. Redecorative. Armor plating, nine percent. really meleeing, so let's just hard weave. That's not bad. Medical interface. I think the medical interface is honestly the best with 2.3 health regen per second. So we are going to go with that. And then Ashley sure I want that and then tally that's probably better than the medical but that's what's what I'm gonna use I have no idea what junk is here because you just gotta omni gel this shit yourself one by one and it's annoying. Uh there we go. Right now we'll hold on to anything three and up, I guess. Well we'll get rid of the armor plating. We'll get rid of a couple of the motorized joints. Because you never know what I might change to. What I might decide, you know, might be better down the road or later on or whatever. But this is going to take a little bit longer than I thought. This is uh, this is definitely DLC. Um, I don't even remember. I don't even think I had this. Uh, so, yeah. Pistol, shotgun, and sniper rifle. I think the pr the pistol we're good with for now. Oh, hello. Another pistol, another assault rifle, and another assault rifle. Okay. Uh, Ashley. Oh, yeah. Yes. Um, yes. You really don't need that. And no. Neither one of these are better. At least not really. Not in my eyes, anyway. You might like better heat sink capacity, and I can see the, the draw for that, but I just like pure raw damage. Alright, so two torches down, one to go, including the leader. Which I'm 
guessing we gotta go to the main facility. That one. That's not the other torch. So where's the other torch? Oh, I guess it is this one that we haven't gone to. Alright, well, that's the one we gotta go to. I'm not going to the main facility right yet. Oh yeah, there it is. radar detects anti-vehicle demolitions nearby. Proceed on foot. Yeah. Hostile contact! Why, why the hell do I have a... I, I, I wasn't even thinking, what was, I wasn't even thinking, what was that? <laughs> Oops. At least it saves when we get out of the vehicle. I wasn't even thinking, gee, what was that? got my check from people's score uh, yesterday in the mail along with my final piece. I'll hopefully get my gold wing up and going. Uh, I can't say how much the check's for because that will spoil things, but it was definitely nice, especially uh, in a time where I had to pay $815 just to fix my Sebring because it had a starter issue. Not a starter, but a, a distributor issue with starter wires in the place. Came out to be pretty damned expensive. Warning. Ground penetrating radar detects anti-vehicle demolitions nearby. Proceed on foot.
Okay, we're in. <laughs> ah, keep those <laughs> keep those guns out, people. Release the Baron. Pistol, another assault rifle. All right. Also, make sure we peek around for anything that we might be able to get on the way in and out. You know, like we ran into last time, containers hidden behind something or whatever. about to have a very bad day, Mr. Dude. So we're about to kill your last torch. Shotgun, assault rifle, sniper rifle. Okay. Well, that takes care of all three torches. Now we just go to the main facility. Hold it right there! This doesn't have to end in bloodshed! Wanna bet?
Negative contacts, Commander. All right, I forgot. We also got levels, didn't we? Yes, we did. We got levels. Um, let's continue on basic armor because we can get that. And then uh, we'll bump up throw. Ashley. I really just want to continue her assault rifles and get her as far up as possible. And then Tally. Um... We'll get her to the next level hacking. If you didn't want it to end in bloodshed, you shouldn't have come with your guns drawn, dude. That's... Negotiations 101. This is gonna be a long episode, but so be it. This is a long... This is, you know, a hell of a DLC I'm doing. Well, it kind of bugs me that my pistol upgrade went from pistol level 1 to pistol level 4, and I had to come to a DLC to get an upgraded pistol. Don't that shit look fun down there? That's a lot of rockets. I just... Yep, I can get right up here. I'm hoping to be able to hit from a high ground down onto the main facility. take damage here, I think, just because there's so many of these things. Rocket kill! I was wow. Okay, dude. Honestly, that was not a good position to approach from. I didn't have a lot of uh, area to move, so yeah, I needed more area where I could back up. All right, one more time. Main facility is there. I want to approach from where I can actually get some room. I didn't think those other rockets were hitting me like they were. It's my issue. Hopefully, approach the facility from another direction. That's a little bit 
better than what we were. Well, certainly a lot better than what we were. Should be able to yeah. hook it up around to here. That's just the left side. bothered they haven't activated yet. Alright, we did get that one. Mr. Bad Guy.
Wow, there's a lot here. You're almost more trouble than you're worth. I'm just getting started. Predictable, but this is over. Is I'm it? leaving this asteroid. If you try to stop me, I'll detonate these charges, and your helper and her friends are all going to die. No. I can't just let you go, Balak. Not after what happened here. This is nothing! You humans have done far worse to the Batarians! We've been forced into exile, forced to survive on what we can scrounge up. It's been like that for decades. Why take it out on these people? They didn't do anything to you or the Batarians. True. Didn't do anything? Aside from colonizing a world that could have been ours? Aside from using resources that should have been ours? We were left to defend ourselves, but the humans were stronger than us. We knew that. The Council knew that. But it didn't matter. It was you. You and your kind are the only reason we're in this position. How does killing innocent people make up for that? We had no other options. Sometimes you need to get someone's attention before they'll listen. That's why we attacked you at Elysium. That's why I'm doing this. You forced our hand! You attacked us first. When we retaliated, you ran off to the Council, hoping for help. When you didn't get it, you hid. You've got no one to blame but yourselves. Enough! You couldn't possibly understand. Actually, you just don't want to understand, and I'm done wasting my breath. Now, if you want your friends to live, I suggest you step aside. Save the hostages would be to let them go. To attack them would be to kill the hostages. That would be a... a... <laughs> I want to kill him so bad. But this is the right thing. You can do. go. 
But this isn't over. I'll find you eventually. Maybe. But I made sure you won't follow me today. Those charges are still on a timer. Better hurry if you want to save your friends. Think we got him, Commander. Great, I gotta figure this out. Letting him go was better than the alternative. I thought you were going to stay someplace safe. I... There might have been something I could have done to help. I thought I should be here. I know this asteroid better than anyone. You did it. Another hour in our course would have been irreversible. I ran the numbers, Shepard. X-57 would have struck near the capital city. The most densely populated region. 
But that's not going to happen, thanks to you. Is Katie in here? Is she all right? Is her team? Balak was holding them hostage. I let him go to save them. Let a terrorist go or sacrifice innocent lives. I'm glad that's not a choice I had to make. Is that... Will you get in trouble for that? I mean, he could do the same thing somewhere else, couldn't he? The Alliance has a whole navy full of people like me, waiting to take him down. We'll be watching. Shepard, thank you for my grandchildren's lives. I don't think I'll stick around, though. Not with the team gone. Too many ghosts. It's time for me to get back and spend some time with my family. Before I go, I'd like to offer you something. Maybe you'll have more use for it than I will. As lead engineer, I get some quality items. Take your pick. You've earned it. I, could use a better... I know it's a lot to ask, but that Omni tool of yours? I could really use something like that. Shepard, I think I mentioned that you saved my kids and grandkids. What's an Omni tool compared to that? You take it, with my blessing. I hope you get good use out of it. One more thing. You asked me to look into your missing engineers. Have you found them? Yes, all of them. Their bodies, anyway. Oh. I... I see. Well then, I guess it's better than not knowing. Take care of yourself. Be well, Shepard. We owe you. I can't believe you let Balak go. To save us. I half expected you to just let us die. Sacrifice the few for the many. Then I'd be no better than the Batarians. Besides, Balak won't get away with this. I know who he is now. He can't run forever. <laughs> you sound like my brother. He was always so stubborn, but always willing to do the right thing, no matter what. I wish I could have saved him, too. It's not your fault. You did what you could. At least Aaron died in the place he loved. He was the one who convinced me to join the team here. Said it would be an adventure. Boy, was it. Uh, I, I don't mean to sound ungrateful, but I should see to Aaron. I understand. You've been through enough today. I'll get out of your way. Thank you. Oh, I don't even know your name. Shepard. Commander Shepard. Thank you, Commander Shepard. You're not exactly what I expected, but thank you. I'll get out of your way. So long, Kate. I appreciate that, Commander. Goodbye.
I don't know if there'll be anything else to say to the crew. This recording's been more than long enough. We're not going to find out on this one. I'll bop around and talk to a couple of the crew members to see if they say anything new on the next round. But until then, folks, yoink. That's going to be me done for this episode. I hope you've enjoyed watching this as much as I've been enjoying bringing it to you. Until next time, this will be one big bug. I'm going to be signing out. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. <gasps> until next time.